Alvo. I'm Omega. And we are Alpha and Omega. And this is Alpha and Omega's Retro Unboxing! Ayo! So, today... By the power of Greystone! Oh, Omega, I've got the power. What? No, I've got the power! I'll make you cringer. You'll, you'll be bad, okay? What? Yeah. But I've got he man Alright. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so today it's our first retro unboxing. Retro and, uh, unboxing! Each, each, uh, each week that we do these, once a month, we're going to be doing a uh, Masters of the Universe figure. Now first up, we decided to go with, with E-Man and Skeletor, and uh, rather than open a 1983 uh, He-Man and Skeletor, which would have been way too much money, uh, we went with the the recent uh, adult collector re-release of these and so uh, we are going to open these today for you but uh, uh, now going forward we're going to get some of the uh, of the original figures and open them but uh, we wanted to start with He-Man and Skeletor and those are just cost prohibitive to get on card from the you know the But they're release. still not like the cheapest figures in the world though let's no, be but... clear about that by no means. So, yeah. Not more than I paid when I was... It was a, than anyone paid for me when I was a kid. Masters of the Universe He-Man. Yeah, on card. Definitely, it's not mint. And they've got some wrinkles in the corners. But, I mean, it's still... Yeah. No. Well, I mean, it's still... Now, this, now the, the Skeletor, it should be noted, the car, the uh, bubble has yellowed. But uh, oh, I don't know whether that on purpose, maybe just to make it look <laughs> like it's older. Oh, I, don't I don't know whether they did that on purpose or whether the whether I'm thinking that the blue plastic may have outgassed into uh, into the inside of the car, uh, the bubble and, and changed its color. I don't know. It would be interesting to see if they did they do a faker. I don't know that they did a faker. So <clears throat> excuse me, they do have a, a lot of figures on the back here. Not all of them available. Oh, you've got different ones. Stratos not available. Many Faces not available. Rare Man not available. Mine's an old school 8 back. What's yours? 12? The 12 back? Uh, it's a 12 back. Oh. Um, so just a moment here, but they have three actual good guys. They've redone six villains. They do have a faker on here. Wait, three? Who are the good guys on there? So we've got He-Man. Yeah. Uh, Tila. Yeah. The warrior goddess. Yeah. And uh, Man at Arms. Yeah. Well, Only they, good guys. They had yeah. many faces there, didn't they? Yeah, many faces. Stratos and Red Man are not available. Oh, you mean actually. Oh, you don't mean on the card. I mean, on the, excuse me, on the card they're there, but oh. they're not available actually for purchase. Hope, oh. I'll, hope I've had them all on there. But they do have Skeletor, Beast Man, Merman, a Faker, Evil Robot, and Skeletor, okay. Cyclops, and Trapper. So it would be interesting to see if the Fakers. Had a, a yellow bubble. All right, you ready yeah. to break into these? Let's go toys? ahead and get <coughs> <laughs> magic trick. Right. So the old school comic here. Oh, it's it's he man. Oh, battle in the clouds. I've got King of Castle Grayskull. He man and the masters. Actually, it says Masters of the Universe. It doesn't actually say he man on there. Yeah. Yeah. Cat fur. So, as was always the case, it comes with a bent Havoc staff. Yeah! <laughs> My Havoc staff is bent! Mm, that's alright, that does that. Yeah. Oh, we. Alright, so, let's get out of his sword. Yeah, yeah. He's got. Now you noticed, so we're going through folks, I don't know whether you've checked it out, but we're going He-Man Mondays, every Monday we do a new episode of He-Man with Gammer, and uh, we uh, we just started, but uh, you know, you can always catch those, and uh, <coughs> Omega noticed the other day uh, that when Skeletor and He-Man were facing off against one another, that He-Man and Skeletor were swords, Looked exactly the same, and in point of fact, slot, pin. <gasps> they combine! Get out of town! Mind blown! Boom! I didn't know they did that! What? 
That's crazy. He didn't tell me they did that. He was leaving it as a surprise. 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 And so I've got a battle axe. He means battle axe there. Oh, he doesn't like to stand up. And his shield. And of course, his sword that when he pulls from his scabbard, he says, I have a power. I have the power. Oh, I have the power. And so, just like old school, the little noggins are squeezable. Oh, he's like that. And when you twist his <laughs> wrist, he gives up. Whoops. Whoop. He flings his sword off of his back. When you twist him, he gives a power punch. Wakow! You've got to be careful with it. Wakow! <laughs> I've lost his sword. You did. When I lived a wretched sword, I've got to get him. You didn't deserve it. No! I've got you back from the Lady of the Lake. Wait. Wouldn't it rather be the sorceress? Yeah, that's what I said. The Lady of the Lake. Slash! I don't know that you even deserve to be playing with that e man toy. E man. <laughs> so, it is a. As far as I remember. So, I never had the actual Skeletor. The regular old, you know, this one. I had the one where the. the, the I forget what it's called, but where you hit him and it gives you, he switches up and gives you battle damage and then you hit him again and he does another battle damage and then you turn it and reset it. That's the Skeletor I had. So, um, I wasn't all about, you know, 15 different Skeletors. Um, so, but this is, as I recall, exactly as Skeletor was. Now, I don't remember my, I think my Skeletor had his feet painted all the way around. And I should also note that in between his <laughs> fingers here, uh, I don't know if you can see that or not. Let me put this one down so you might have a better chance. In between his fingers there, they they aren't exactly uh, cut out properly or, you know, properly pulled out of the mould. Mm. Um, they could have been shaved a little more. Yeah. <clears throat> but, but, I mean, those are... Such minor things, I don't know. Like, so, I mean, the feet are weird. Don't get me wrong, but but there were always paint errors on all all my human toys, so that doesn't surprise me. <laughs> Excuse me. So we do have He Man here, of course, and he's got. Oh, he does. <laughs> he does want to throw it. He throw, and then he's got his shield and his flowy blonde hair, classic form. Well, and of course, he's got his you know, number one on his chest. He's you know his. I would rather not reach between your legs oh, than the <laughs> So he's painted all the way around, the shield's got some paint on it. You know, his, his uh, loin cloth and belt and everything. The only thing he doesn't, it's weird, he's kind of got like like bucklers, but it is just flesh tone. No. <sighs> now, I will tell you, his shield looks a little strange to me. Awesome. What? What's up? <clears throat> so, I'll, I'll actually be right, oops, be right back. Be right back, folks. <clears throat> So, uh, what I wanted to show you, what I wanted to go get, was an ori my original He-Man shield. It looks like it's a different colour a little. Yeah. I think it's not only a different colour, but it is constructed differently. So, the new one is a solid shield with a dark red in there. You see? And that's the same red that's on his, uh, on his chest plate, it appears. This is the original He-Man. And, as you can see, the original was actually two pieces, and that is actually some sort of, I believe, paper or cardboard uh, insert in there. What, wouldn't you say that um, that's what that is, Amiga, rather than... Yeah, and I can actually see some, some white... Looking into this one, if you look at it at enough of an angle, you can see some light in there. 
You can you can see the edge of the. It looks like, excuse me, the edge of the card where it's like the painting. Yeah, that's the that's. See, look, I can depress it a little bit, and you can see the edge of the plastic. Oh, is that what that is? Yeah, show the folks at home what you. What oh, you've... it's a trick of yeah, the plastic and these shades. There was no and... trick. Is the lighting? I couldn't see it. It looked like it was bright white. Yeah, it's just the plastic and these are the Okay, I get it. Yeah. Perhaps he was using his echolocation. So, uh, <laughs> the blinds are bad. <laughs> uh, so, <laughs> but anyway, so the, so I, I did find that a, a slightly interesting. And does it look? Is it just an optical illusion? Are they different sizes? Slightly. Yeah, they do appear to be a different, different, slightly different like size. Slightly different size. Skeletor. What? I mean, you know. <laughs> Power punch. I am curious. <laughs> what? What the other differences are? We may do an inspectacle with uh, with these figures and maybe their original counterparts at some point. Uh, but we'll have to check that. Give me a sword. Now, now. Yes. Now I have yeah. this some kind of super sword thing. I don't get in gray skull yet. Here. I'm now. super he man. So I never knew he had this little belt. Mine didn't have the belt. He just had. Uh, just had his, you know, his uh, loincloth. Yeah. yeah, the Havoc staff always had this wonky bend in it. it. It it eventually comes a little bit out, but it's such soft plastic that I imagine you could probably, if you wanted, you could probably train it by bending it exactly the opposite way right. but you'd have to you'd have to get it you'd have to play with it so much to get it exactly right that it was tough in there do wielding he man so now the interesting thing is he, as you can tell he doesn't actually hold the two the two the double sword particularly well now does he in his in his hand where it seems actually he's supposed to hold the sword when i was a kid oh, there we go yeah yeah, okay. when I was a kid, yeah, I, I always would. I would put the, uh, I would put the the smaller end, because he can he can hold the smaller end. No, oh. yeah, it's kind of sideways. Well, yeah, yeah. but who cares? Well, show. Not that they ever used it as a sword. Mm, they no, throw it at things. Well, you or... know, blocking a blocking sword. <laughs> Not as a <laughs> as an offensive <laughs> sword per se. What's he mean? It was a show of peace and understanding. <laughs> Hello, Kikau! That is, that is quite a nice, uh, <laughs> nice, uh, bah! Ah, he man! Ah, Kikau! Ah, ha, ha! I'll get into gay skull yet, he man! <laughs> ninja stuff! <laughs> ninja stuff. I learned that from Jitsu! <laughs> Yo, Joe <George> Jitsu. <laughs> what a character that is, eh? <laughs> So. Obscure. Well, what did you think? What did you think of, of, of your first uh, your first He Man toys? I like he gives a good power punch. He's like, oh, cow. I will know. Since I didn't have this figure, I never knew this. He has the horde symbol. Now, in the in the uh, show, of course, he doesn't have his horde symbol on his on his thing there. In a lot of the comics and other things, he certainly did. But uh, so that's interesting. So this is Skeletor. I guess at, right after he. He uh, stops being, or maybe when he still yeah. is a minion of, of Horde. Yeah, it's not it. yeah. Look at this. Yeah, so I'm quite pleased. And so uh, now tune in, you know, in a month's time, or uh, next week. Um, tomorrow we have Gundam every day, folks. So, every uh, single day of the week. We're not exaggerating there. No, no. Sometimes um, twice. Sometimes twice. We, yeah. Three, I mean day. <laughs> we, three yeah. days a week, twice. Twice, three days a week. <laughs> Tree time. King. Oh yeah, and then it returns. He's BA. He's got he's got great perks. Yeah, yeah. So oh, we'll, we'll, we'll and, return. Oh so, yeah, we don't want to get the a comic. No, this isn't so quite the quality has, of the comic as I recall, but this might be an early one. Has uh, some statistics. It's, and it's more matte than what I recall. Although it is thicker cardstock on the outside. Like, I don't remember. I've got another one of these around. Um, Featuring the sorceress, but this one, uh, it's it's thicker cardstock because it used to be, as I recall, all the same, and it was just glossy, 
glossy pages all the way through. Interesting, like oh, it's a Stratos and Merman. Stratos, does he have blue wings on yours? So Strato, depending on the source, Stratos has different coloured wings and a different coloured harness. In the cartoon, it's obviously inverse from that. It's a you know red wings blue harness, but yeah, no, and some totally some blue of blue the toys wings. actually were uh, blue wings red harness. So, so Teeler is I mean it has like some sort of serpent stare. Yeah, <clears throat> and I mean Skeletor's skull face is fine. I'll note in this one, uh, Stratos has red wings blue harness. So hmm. interesting, yeah, which yeah. is much more what we used to do. So. All right. Well, yeah. until next time. That's this time. For Alpha, for Mumaga. Ayo! Hey